Hi, y'all. It's Michael Klaus, real estate broker with Team Navigators at Keller Williams Realty Services. Thanks for joining me for another episode of our Real Estate 101 series. And today I'm excited to be introducing you to Mr. Scott Forte. Scott is with Assurance Financial here in Mandeville. How are you doing, Scott? Doing great, buddy. How about you? Doing great. Doing great. So in the Real Estate 101 series, we're really trying to introduce people to the behind the scenes heroes who really help us offer exceptional customer service and explain some of the basic concepts of real estate and real estate transactions. And so today I wanted to kind of pick your brain a little bit about credit score and how it pertains to someone's ability to borrow money, uh, what minimum credit scores are for different types of loans and things like that. So what can you tell us? Yeah. So. Credit, I mean, I've been, been been doing mortgages for almost 20 years and credit is obviously it's a way to measure your ability to repay a debt. So what lenders look at is they look, they want to see that trend and how you manage your money and your payment history and all that. So um, establishing credit can be as simple as opening up a secured credit card. If you have no credit at all, go to your local bank, whoever you bank with, uh, put up uh, $500, sometimes you can just do 500 bucks and have them do a secured uh, line of credit to establish trade lines. You wanna make sure they report to all three credit bureaus, uh, Experian, Equifax, TransUnion, um, charge on that credit card, pay it down, pay it off, and just kinda, kinda get a, a trade line established. But um, you can also have your utility companies report to your credit as well to get uh, what's called alt trade lines. And uh, those will help you uh, kind of gain some traction for showing a payment history that can that can help you get your scores up. Um, credit card debt uh, typically is the fastest way to increase your scores. If you're looking to buy and you got maxed out credit cards, um, we can run a little rapid rescore, or, or it's called a score wizard with our credit bureau to pay down. It'll actually tell you how much you need to pay down certain credit cards to get to achieve a certain score. Um, typically you want to keep them at 30% of your high credit limit or less for optimal scoring. Um, but, uh, installment debts are probably way in at about 20% of your credit score. Uh, mortgage, uh, is going to probably be, you know, close to like 20% of your score, but 50 and 10% for some other miscellaneous small, um, small trade lines here and there. But, um, your credit, your revolving utilization can be up to 50% of what your how your credit score is impacted so it's, it's really good to manage those those credit cards you know just kind of kind of i tell them if you can't pay cash for it don't charge it you know exactly exactly so it's really a matter of managing your money wisely showing a history of that and that's going to contribute to a higher credit score that's right so what kind of credit scores are most lenders looking for when someone comes in to apply for more <clears throat> It's going to vary from lender to lender. Um, COVID's obviously having a big impact on the, the guidelines and the level of comfort that lenders are willing to lend money at. Um, scores currently for us, I want to say we're at six, uh, 640 for FHA uh, and RD loans and VA, I think we'll go down to 620 conventional 620 right around there. I could be wrong on that. Don't, don't quote me on that. We, we update those sometimes weekly, but uh, right around in there. And then, you know, your other, some lenders might be 680. It's just, it's whatever they are comfortable with setting the bar at. So, um, but I think as time goes on, they're gonna they're gonna loosen those guide, guidelines up a little more to be able to go back down to the, the 580 FHAs that we used to have. And um, that, that to income ratio limitations are starting to tighten tighten down on those a little bit, but uh, all in all, um, I mean, it's still a great time to buy a house. The rates are at record lows. I've never seen lo rates this low ever in my life or in the history of my, you know, almost 20 year mortgage career. <laughs> but uh, so yeah, that's kind of that's kind of where we are with scores. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rates are low and, and you know, credit scores I think are, are some lenders are seeming to, to kind of loosen up a little bit and, and allow slightly lower credit scores on some of the programs and so uh it gives opportunity to people to buy a home especially first-time home buyers may not have a lot of money to put down using some of those programs 
and, uh, and that's a good thing. So Scott, if someone wanted to contact you to apply for a mortgage or learn more about Credit Score, how could they get in touch with you? Well, they could call my, they can call or text my team number and it's 985-275-0334. And that is manned by my entire team. So we try not to miss anything on there. Uh, and uh, as well as my team email. So the email uh, that you can get all of us at is gonna be teamforte at assurancemortgage.com. So okay. those are the two, uh, two main lines, two mainstream lines of communication. Um, we've got some pretty cool technology in terms of getting, you, getting your application uh, into the system. We send out mobile application links that you can do on your phone. We can text them to you. Literally, you can close your entire loan from your cell device. Yeah, yeah, you guys are really um, have some some cool stuff there. Uh, I can attest to that with some of the clients we've worked with together, and uh, right. and and like I said, this series is about showing the behind the scenes he heroes, just like you, Scott, who who really do offer that exceptional service to our clients. And we appreciate you so much, and uh, really hope you keep up the good work. And uh, yeah, let's 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 keep it going, man. Sounds good. I appreciate it, Michael. All right, Scott, thanks. Thanks bye -bye. for having me. All right, bye-bye.